And this is why we often talk about a cult, which is a group of people that follows a person blindly with a level of devotion that makes it basically impossible to understand and receive reality. We say it because apparently there still are people that say that Project 2025 is made up by the Democratic Party, when Project 2025 is nothing but the current version of Project 2021, which was hand-delivered to the White House in July of 2020 to provide the Trump administration with a blueprint of what they should do in a supposed second administration. And it's the current version of Project 2017, which according to the Heritage Foundation itself, the Trump administration embraced, and in fact, it achieved almost 70% of the objective that the then Project 2017 had set aside, including things like repealing net neutrality and withdrawing from the Paris Climate Accord. We also talk about a cult when we refer to people that say that Project 2025 is made up by the Democratic Party because people say things like this, even in the face of evidence that shows that uh, Trump was keynote speaker more than once at the Heritage Foundation, which is the organization that develops then publishes, then distributes Project 2017, 21, and now Project 2025, which is also known under the name of a mandate for our nation. And Trump, during these keynote speak, talked about, you guessed it, a mandate. This, for example, is a photo of Trump shaking hands with the head of the Heritage Foundation. We talk about a cult because when it comes to comments like these, for those who write them or believe them, it isn't about policies. It isn't about political platform. It's just about the type of blind allegiance that you can expect from the, well, poorly educated. 